Hello, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I haven't been posting any videos for a long while. Sorry about that. Uh, there are reasons for that, uh, which I will explain to you in this video. Um, today I'm out um, just um, scouting uh, landscape photography um, because uh, I haven't been out for I don't know six weeks or so, week six weeks or, or something like that. Um, and I just thought I, I needed to to get out to. Uh, at least do some scouting today. The only camera I brought today is um, the phone that is filming me right now. And then this um, film camera, um, Rode 35, it's a 35 mil um, camera, nice little thing, just easily fits fits in your hand and, uh, and with a hand strap and that's all. So, uh, and I put some black and white film in it. I won't show you any of these pictures because I'm just, I just brought it just in case. I haven't taken any pictures today. Uh, but what I want to talk about this in, in this video is uh, the reasons why I've been um, been uh, away for so long and what has happened uh, in my life, you could say, and, um, and what's been uh, going on. Um, I gotta warn you right now, in just, 10 seconds there'll be a picture on the screen that might be not so pleasant to people don't be offended by it it's just um well there's some blood and uh, the image is coming up uh, in uh, five four three two one now that's me standing in the bathroom yeah it's gone now uh and i might well as well take these off so you can see me uh, sorry about that um I've had an operation uh, in my nose, uh, you know, those uh, where there's nothing up up here. I don't recall what they're called, all these uh, caves in your in your chins here um, and uh, in the nose and open, open the, the forehead. Um, you know, I've had this um, these infections uh, for a long time and they uh, infected my lung, lungs as well because it was running back at night. And running down through the lungs and the lungs are not working very well as you may know uh, i may have mentioned that in a previous video i i, I have uh, and this infects all that and also my arthritis um, makes it um, more difficult for me to breathe than than people without this arthritis and this kind of arthritis and the arthritis and the uh, emphysema in the lung and then this nose uh, thing all um, Combined makes made made it uh, very difficult for me to 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 breathe and to uh, to be very active. So I haven't been very active for about six months or so. Uh, and as part of that, the um, the um, this this operation in the nose came a bit uh, quicker uh, than um, it was supposed to because everything is postponed because of the COVID. But the situation here in Denmark is so good, so you can start getting these kind of normal operations and I was put up uh, on the list um, to get that done because it influenced my lungs so much so I've got all those um, doors you could say all those holes out uh, they've been um, made bigger uh, and I've uh, had my uh, all those caves they're not called caves I've, I've put something here so you can see what it's called up here I think um, They've been cleaned out uh, and washed and, and, and stuff like that. And then I had this operation and I came home the same day uh, and it was bleeding, as you could see on that, uh, in that picture. And uh, that was not very fun. Um, then I have to rinse with salt water. After two days, I needed to start rinsing with salt water five times a day, uh, which I've been doing ever since. And it, this, the operation was around the 7th of May and now it's the 6th of June, so it's a month ago. Um, the other problems uh, problem um, in relation to that is that the medicine I take for my um, arthritis actually uh, lowers my immune system. I've made a video about that as well. Um, I will link to that in the description um, so you can see uh, if you want to see that. Um, and that combined with the risk. Well, because there was a risk of infection, um, I couldn't take that medicine uh, up to the operation. And then after the operation, my nose did, in fact, get infected uh, very bad um, in two times. Uh, the first one, I 
we managed to uh, to hand with some penicillin, but then I got another infection uh, up in my forehead with some uh, kind of um, very um, rare uh, bacteria. I don't know why, but it and it's all um, there was some cloth up here with some blood and stuff, and it was closed, so it couldn't run out, and it was quite painful. So, so I went to the hospital again. And then I went to the hospital again this Monday to to have my uh, my check after the operation, and it looks fine. It's healing nicely up there, and uh, there's not uh, too much of an issue up there yet. Uh, but unfortunately, my nose is uh, like it's kind of S-shaped, uh, and that was not uh, possible to fix because they tried to do that several years ago, and then it started bleeding, and that operation just completely uh, failed. Uh, but the um, the wall between left and right side in the nose is uh, is so thin after that first operation that you can't do anything else so i don't have that much you can hear this is better um this side is uh, is not too good so yeah so i had to rest for two weeks after the operation then i got all these infections and then yeah you know so what I've been doing uh, in the meantime is I've been playing around, around with some old uh, film cameras. Uh, I'll probably make some videos about that uh, because I did what I've done before. I, I managed to buy a lot of gear on an auction and uh, yeah, keeping some of it, uh, selling something else. Uh, and I'm still in the process of narrowing, narrowing in to which um, medium format film camera I want to use. Uh, but I think I've made up my mind uh now i just need to find it and that could be a problem so yeah so that's what's been going on on this channel and uh, now what is going to happen is uh, i'm going to um well to start working on uh, uh on some videos again but but in the meantime yeah i forgot that sorry uh i've closed my business so uh, i'm technically unemployed right now which is the first time in I don't know how many years. And there's a lot of rules and there's a lot of stuff you got to do nowadays. Uh, in the early days, it was it was easier. But now you have to do uh, every kind of, well, basically at this point, online meetings, but still a lot of meetings and a lot of talks and a lot of papers you have to fill in and online uh, still, but a lot of stuff you got to do. Um, and you have to it's a stupid uh, law because you have to apply for jobs that you don't want because it's not a, about um, applying for jobs that may suit you because I'm a social worker. Uh, it's also just about you have to apply for a certain amount of jobs each week and each month. And so inevitably you have to, well, you, you will apply for jobs that you don't want and then doesn't suit you and you may well know that you make this very fine application because you have to do that uh, again in order to to uh, comply with the rules uh, but you have to make all these very fancy and very nice applications uh, knowing that you are not going to get the job because you're not qualified for it or there's a few bits and pieces missing and also because of my uh, physical situation, I am not able to take just any job. I can't work with kids, for example. Uh, that will be impossible for me to to go bent down or lifting uh, kids around. That's that's not possible. So I may seem an okay fit, but I'm not. Trust me. Um, so that's quite a an odd situation. But um, but I'll see if I can manage to to make some uh, videos in the meantime. I'm also going to uh, at a physiotherapist uh, who um, I get some massages on my back because my back is totally uh, tight and the muscles are just so full of strain um, and I need to loosen that up and then I need to start training uh, the whole uh, upper part of my body in order to be better to breathe. And mm. um, so that's also something I, I spend a lot of time doing and I do a lot of uh, training at home. Um, and then I get tired because of the lungs and yeah, so it's just this circle of, uh, it's not a circle of confusion, if you know what that is, but it's more a circle of, uh, yeah, it's a bad circle really. Um, but it's okay in the sense that, that, uh, something is happening and I'm, I'm, 
doing what I'm supposed to do and, and really trying to to get back um, to um, well, to some kind of functionality, um, which will be uh, satisfying for me and for my wife and for my friends and for my family and all that. So, uh, and then of course uh, getting that job that's quite essential. Uh, I really need to uh, to find something to do, uh, which suits me, suits my uh, physique, uh, and so on. Um, because, um, yeah, so because of all that, uh, my mental, I was going crazy. Uh, I really needed to, to get out. And uh, my intention today was to go out and, and shoot, bring a camera, shoot some pictures in the, in the books or, or something like that. But but uh, it's in the middle of the day, it's totally bright sunlight. You can see that up here uh, in the sky over there. Um, it's, there's nothing happening, there's nothing. Um, you could go in the forest and make something, but uh, I decided just to drive around uh, new places, uh, have a little uh, just walking in and finding some path and see this might be uh, a forest that I can go to on a later stage and this might not be. And uh, I was in fact out um, just a few minutes ago in a place where I believed that was uh, a good place to go, but there was no, no way I could get into that forest uh, really. Um, without bringing some boots and some long trousers and stuff like that. And it's 24 degrees today. It's burning hot and I'm sweating. You can probably see it. Um, so, uh, no, not today. But uh, nice to know that I know that area. Um, it might be a good place to go in the winter, I believe, because there's some old trees and um, some... It's not total original forest, old um, ancient forest, but it's still one of the older forests uh, or part of the forests around here because there's a lot of woodland around here so um, it might be a place to go uh, another day so yeah so that's it for this uh, video just to tell you that uh, i'm still alive uh, and uh, and uh, i'm i'm also alive and kicking but i'm not kicking as hard as i used to be uh, used to do used to be kicking used to do the kicking used to I don't kick as hard as I used to be able to, something like that. Um, yeah, so uh, hang on, uh, stay tuned. I might not, um, I'm pretty sure that I won't be uh, uploading a video each week, but I'll try to to partially uh, partially uh, get, back, get back on track and, um, and, and at least uh, just uh, so you can see that I'm alive uh, once in a while. Uh, yeah. Um, and to end this, I will show you some uh, one by one uh, square images uh, in color. This time, uh, it's the last part of that uh, testing out of the six by six format. So uh, I'll show you these uh, in the end here. And um, I hope you have a nice week and uh, a nice summer. Uh, see you back soon. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment.